long time. He is one of the greatest players in the history of college basketball. He was a first ballot Hall of Famer after his career in the NBA. He was a dream teamer, and he has paid his dues for the opportunity he now has to be the head coach at Georgetown. It's our pleasure to welcome Patrick Ewing to my Hello. Good morning, Coach. How are you today? Hi. Good morning, fellas. How are you guys doing? Great, and, and I, I, I guess I really want to start with this, and we've talked about it a lot over the last couple of days. The way that you were willing to pay your dues as an assistant coach for 15 years after a player, that's being a player of your prominence and making as much money, candidly, as you did as a player, that's not something you had to do. So you demonstrated just how badly you wanted to be a coach. Was there ever a time over those 15 years that you thought to yourself, this isn't worth it, I'm, I'm not going to continue this, and you thought about walking away from this? So, you know, I feel like I was blessed. Uh, you know, I was blessed to work with 